What's up guys, Hongi and OG Fitness. Welcome to the channel. If you're new, consider subscribing. This video is about Bruce Lee. Was he naughty or not? Naughty, for those of you guys who might not know, uh, it means natural or not, right? And meaning, did he take steroids or not? The reason why I'm making this video is because I'm a... Uh, I'm a fan of Greg Doucette. He's a YouTuber, a uh, fitness YouTuber, and uh, he's blowing up right now. And he's very popular for making naughty or not videos on actors, on other YouTubers, on bodybuilders, and uh, you know, all kinds. And those videos get a lot of views, so that's why he makes a lot of those, but he also has a lot of other videos on um, you know, nutrition, training, and all that, which I, I recommend anybody to go watch. I think his information is super legit. At one point, I was um, fumbling around on YouTube, I see a thumbnail of Bruce Lee, Naughty or Not, by Greg Doucette. Like never, it never crossed my mind that Bruce Lee is not natural. I mean, he's, he's cut, he's ripped, but he's not big. And I don't know, I just never, it just never crossed my mind. So now somebody asked that in, in the video, in Greg Doucette's video, because it was a Q&A, but then one of the questions there was uh, regarding Bruce, if he was naughty or not. And Greg said said yes, he thinks that Bruce was on steroids. Now, the reason he said that is because one, back in those days, steroids didn't have the stigma that it has today. It wasn't seen as um, something that's bad, kind of like smoking. Like back in those days in the 70s, 60s, like you even had doctors that would promote smoking, saying that it was good for you. So steroids wasn't seen as a bad thing at all. I'm not even sure if it was illegal. So for those of you guys who know, well, you know, just comment down below, of course. You know, and, and what happens, he believes that Bruce, after his back injury, because for those of you guys who don't know, he busted his back really, really bad. He wasn't supposed to walk after that. Bruce being Bruce, he overcame that. But after that, he believes that because Bruce was also in the movie business, so he made a living out of, you know, looking good, looking a certain way. Of course, his skill set and all that in martial arts. As lean as he was, it wouldn't surprise Greg Doucette that, uh, you know, he did take something. Like, he didn't, of course, take crazy amounts, according to Greg, because, you know, he's not that big and also, but I mean, he did take something, according to Greg. So now, what do I think uh, uh, in regards to this? I think that, honestly, from what I've read about Bruce, and I'm a big Bruce Lee fan, and this takes away nothing, in my opinion, of the type of person he is, his legacy, and all that, you know? Uh, you guys know, like, even my logo, that's that's pretty much ripped off from Bruce Lee, and I just put my OG on, you know, because, well, hey, it's me. Highly, highly influenced by Bruce Lee, very inspired by him. A lot of the things I do, a lot of things, uh, my whole martial arts journey, essentially, was, uh, was sparked by him, right? So, what I'm saying is that I wouldn't be surprised if he did, and I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't, right? We don't know. Now, maybe people in his entourage knows, but you know, they wouldn't say stuff like that because now it's so, but when you say that, it just, it, it would just taint his legacy, uh, you know? So I'm sure that people who actually do know who are in his entourage wouldn't go out even if uh, he did. To me, it doesn't make any difference at all. So I wouldn't be surprised if he did. I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't. One thing too is that when you look at, if you read up on Bruce Lee, like you, you, you look at his workouts and, and what other people say uh, regarding his strength and everything, he was like superhuman strength, superhuman speed, and he trained like a maniac. He trained all the goddamn time, guys. And he was doing, he, he had some really impressive feats of strength. You know, he was doing push-ups on like two fingers, man. He was like curling like hundred something pounds like this with a barbell. Not just curling them, like Olympic bars with like, you know, uh, 45 plates and just like 135 pounds, some shit like that. And then like just pressing it out like this while standing and keeping it in, in, in midair and, and doing isometrics. And he was, a, he was, he wasn't a big guy, man. And I'm sure he already had that in him. And of course, after his back injury, like if he started taking stuff and it took, it just took him to another uh, next level. Also, the thing with uh, steroids is that it doesn't, it's not just to make you big. It helps you recover faster too. There's a lot of guys who take steroids and uh, it, it benefits you in terms of recovery and it makes you able to contract your muscles harder. But I'm very curious to see what you guys think about this. So, you know, like back in those days, once again, nobody knew it was bad for you. You know, the science wasn't in yet. Uh, it wasn't even illegal or, yeah, I'm not sure about that, but don't quote me on that. It wasn't seen as anything bad at all. Who knows, man? Who knows, you know? And if you guys uh, bring me some uh, some proof to uh, to support 
Greg Doucette's claim, opinion, that Bruce is, uh, was on something that is not natural, then I'll make a video on it. And if after that you guys bring me some more evidence, you know, information, articles, or whatnot to support the opposite, then I'll, I'll be happy to make a video. Anyways, guys, uh, love you very much. Thank you for watching. Peace. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and click on the notification bell. Also, there's a link down below. If you guys click on it, it's gonna bring you to a page where you could follow me on all my social media platforms, and you can also apply for, uh, for coaching so that you guys can work directly with me. Also, one last thing, guys. If you have any questions, right, send me an email. That's the best way to reach me. I read them, and I'll, I'll answer your, your questions, man. All right, peace.